Hello everybody, welcome back to Oxygen Not Included Spaced Out Edition here on our Cartoons Colony. Alright, well, where are we going? What are we doing? Oh, lots of stuff. You know, the normal stuff. <laughs> We're working on oxygen supplies and temperature controls and yeah, lots of stuff. But uh, And cooking up a storm over here with uh, Speedy Gonzalez. <laughs> He's very speedy with his cooking. Um... So yeah, we're gonna continue to take care of stuff. Um, in the meantime, we got a couple things we need to do. This will need to go up. We want this to remain cold, and we want space for a tank for it to collect. So I think we're gonna come down all the way to here go like this. We're going to be going up. We're going to go across like that. Um, we'll do that. And do that. We'll get that taken care of. Uh, let's not build this out until we get that. So we'll come down here and we'll We'll dig all this out. Should be able to reach up there. Yeah, we will. Cool. So that will take care of this and get us a tank. Um, so when we use up this water, we'll pull it from here and we'll keep it a cold temperature. While I was thinking of, you know, we'll keep spilling it out, we'll keep spilling it out, we'll keep spilling it out. Um, I realize now that it's just better if we just dig out the hot material so that's what we're going to do <clears throat> research wise we are working on this okay where is our oh our, he's up here doing this that's why he's not doing the research all right well we'll finish this and then we'll go catch up on the research we got a lot of stuff to build so that's not a problem. We'll get this picked up so that they're not walking through it. Um, that'll make them a little bit happier over here. There we go. Excellent. Perfect. Good job, guys. Good job. Um, we are going to want to think about how we can start getting these metal volcanoes sealed in as well. Um, let's see. Is this going to be low enough? Yeah, this sealed in but large enough of space that we can cool the metal eventually we can automate it where it picks up the metal and it transports it out yeah so we're gonna have to think of how we can do this effectively Do we want it to where it falls? If it turns to liquid, it just drops down, and then we pick it up down here. But then it, there may be stuff that never gets picked up up here because it never falls. So I think we want to maintain the floor like that. Yeah. So we'll plan that out. We're going to want to do the same thing over here. We probably actually, yeah, we'll want to raise, the, we'll want to raise, no, this door's already raised, okay, cool. So we'll want to make sure we have a raised door, two spaces. So it'll be like that. And we'll do one of, even though this is a carbon dioxide geyser, we're going to want to do the same thing over here. Um, except we're going to be collecting the carbon dioxide. So this ladder will have to go and we'll have to move that. But we'll, we'll go ahead and do that just so that they're enclosed. Cool. All right. Um, what can we prioritize? Tip squeak, sleepy, upside down. Cool. Well, let's prioritize that 
this. I'm gonna do some prioritization. Let's get this done. We'll replace the floor in a moment, but what I want more importantly to do is get this mocked up. There we go. Temperature wise, yeah, this is all hot. We're gonna have to start sealing it all up. Chef. Oh, I guess maybe you don't have anything. How's our oxygen in the base? Good over here, but <laughs> Our sleeping quarters are terrible. <laughs> um, how far are we having? You know what? I'm just gonna stick this here temporarily so that we can get oxygen in our bedrooms. Yeah. Okay, so we've got this done. We've got this hooked up. We have no power here. So our that's our first thing. Now, did we collect coal? I saw coal, right? We have coal on the map. Yeah, we, we can get a bunch of coal over here. All right, so we'll come over here and let's just power through that. Not that one, though. Just to get that coal and algae. And what we'll do is temporarily we we'll put a coal generator here. And a large battery. And a small battery. <laughs> whoops, 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 whoops. Our temporary power cord to there. So this can take a thousand, so we've got 240, 360, three, so 360, so um, I can't count, 460, 560, 600 with the 40. And then these two will be, yeah, that's going to be a thousand to run all of this. So that's okay. We'll have oxygen. Did we get our ventilation done? No, we did not. Um, okay, let's get let's get power over here and let's get this research done, folks. Yep, we finished this right. We did. Cool, next dormant. Okay, we got 41 cycles of liquid production. So, excellent. Okay, we're gonna power through this, get this ready. And then we're gonna have to set up some power generation. Okay, research is complete. Let's come down here. Uh, we're gonna come up all the way to the top and we're gonna get this one, right? Isn't that what we need? Because we need the power... Yeah. We're gonna do that next so that we can get the hydrogen power. We'll probably just put it in right here, close by temporarily at the top here, and just try to use all of this. You know, and in fact... Oops. Um, we'll be putting... it. We'll put two of them. Four, one, two, three, four. Yeah. And so then we can put this, like, right there to just grab some uh, um, grab this hydrogen well we're going to want to put a filter on it to grab this hydrogen out most of it's going to go this way but we can suck the hydrogen out of the out of the area there we go <clears throat> yeah that'll work alright so this is going to come in like this we're also going to put yeah, that's fine. We're also going to go like this. This is our hydrogen pipe. Oh, so we're going to come through the middle. It's going to go like that. Uh, then eventually we'll have oxygen pipes, but this is our first one. I 
it's going to come down to here. Like that. And we'll do a vent there, a vent there. Cool. That'll get hydrogen into the base, cycling down. Uh, then we'll eventually set this one up. Hydrogen. So I'm going to bring this into here, filter it, and this into here, filter it. So we'll, we'll be able to grab plenty of hydrogen. This is going to go like that. Um, we'll need to get rid of this temporarily. So I'm just going to stick it over here. There we go. Cool. Alright, we got this. We don't need the coal in it yet, but we will. Um, we need to finish the liquid conversion. Stick this on a 7 because we're going to need to put in some stuff. Alright, we got everybody building, everybody busy. Let's take a look. I'm not gonna... I don't want to continue. We're getting low on food. So we'll take the larva eggs, and we're going to eat the larva eggs. Yep. Hey, that's omelets, you know? Alright, what do you got? We could do construction, but I think I'm going to get improved carrying first, because we already got a double construction guy, so let's do that first. Okay, then we're going to need some power over here. We'll have to figure out where to put that. I'll probably take one of these, put it down in here in the base, the other one we'll put into this line. As a backup for the coal. Yeah. We've almost got it in. We've got the initial research done. Uh, this research is still happening. Okay, cool. Alright. Excellent. We've delivered some eggs. Let's crack them eggs, and then we will turn them into omelets. There we go. Omelets. Oh, we got some barbecue available. Let's get that done, too. Otherwise, we're going to be short on food. People are going to get hungry. They're not going to be happy. <laughs> well, we don't want that to happen, do we? Temperature-wise, um, this should cool down a little bit because we're no longer producing the massive heat from the electrolyzer. That's the other thing we've got to figure out, is once we get this taken care of, we've got to put in cooling for all of this from our slush bin. Yep. If we don't, we're going to be into trouble. 55 degrees. This is hot, hot water is not going to be helpful here. Okay, we got this research done. We're just doing this one. Excellent. <coughs> uh, we're getting the bedrooms taken care of. Perfect. We are making good progress all over the place. Okay, we got this pipe done. We just have those two little ones. Uh, we still don't have this done, though. So we're going to take this side, and we're going to turn this side to a six. Less priority. We'll concentrate on this. Uh, yeah, we'll concentrate on that. Got this outlet done already, so that's excellent. Research is complete. Oh, good. Um, we should probably go for this next. I mean, we don't need it yet. We will. All right, I'm going to switch it. We're going to come down to the bottom. And I just want to get those two things taken care of. Uh, was we need automation anyways and stuff down there too so all right we'll do that and then here is our oh wait 
So, where's our hydrogen generators? No, 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 no. I don't want that. Yeah, well, okay, well, let's go through these. I never pay attention to these things. Are you done? Okay, cool. Research. Which one of these gives us hydrogen power? Hydrogen, 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 hydrogen. What have I missed? From a hydrogen production standpoint. Do, 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 do. Hydrogen. It's, it's really early on. Oh, it's this one. Okay, well, we're going to switch because we need that as a priority. Okay. <laughs> All right. Here, I thought, okay, we got hydrogen. We can place it. Oh, nope, not yet. We did the wrong one. <laughs> we needed the other one eventually, but we could have. All right. Well, anyways, we'll get it taken care of. <laughs> In, in the, the next day, the next cycle, maybe they can power through it. Meanwhile, we're still accumulating water, so that's excellent. It's 11 degrees and cooling, so we'll keep it going. I don't think we've explored anywhere new to see anything else, though. Yeah, we haven't. Okay. Did we dig this out? Yes, we did. We got our coal. So we have coal for when we need it. Okay, cool things producing more carbon how hot is this carbon dioxide at negative oh it's cold carbon well it's not making much of a difference but that's nice it's cold carbon i might be able to use it produces cold carbon at negative 55 here's our cooling system we don't have to cool with liquid we can cool with this and we can just pump it in into this, pump it into our power areas, pump it into other areas, and we've got cooling. Awesome. Okay, well, we know what we're doing for cooling. <laughs> That's good. In the meantime, we'll finish this stuff. Fortunately, stress is still nice and low, so we are fine. Got a bunch of harvestables, so we're going to cook up a bunch more food. We are keeping up with the food. But we're really not gaining. We will as soon as we have some different food types. Uh, which basically means we need to get up into here um, and get these grub fruits. There is quite a bit of sulfur just visible already, so I think we can probably do a fairly decent grub fruit farm. We're going to have to come up here anyways because of this. Um, so, yep, once we get this stuff done, get our oxygen going and some supplementary power and stuff, um, we'll do more exploration and we will prioritize working on this and getting the carbon dioxide out of here <coughs> for cooling. And then we'll pump the carbon dioxide into a room down here to create oxygen to recycle it. So we've got tons of sand, so we'll be able to use these efficiently. Use up this, this sand here that virtually will last a thousand cycles just in these two boxes. And look, we've got all of that, that, all of this, all of that, and there's all of this. I mean, yeah, there's probably several thousand cycles worth of sand for filtering purposes and glass and other stuff that we may need, so I think we're okay. <coughs> okay, excellent job, excellent job. You guys are doing good. Research, how we doing? We're getting there. <laughs> it's a little bit slower on construction up here because they have to go quite a ways for the realize that this is probably not the best spot simply because eventually all of this is going to be out we have a couple little pockets that are stuck over here um, this is all going to flow up here so maybe what we'll do no we'll, we'll start it here we'll keep it and then we'll take it out and we'll move it yeah. 
eventually we'll dig that up so this isn't trapped. Um, we'll probably hold off on this until we get all the hydrogen out of here. Yeah. I think that's the smart thing to do. Okay, how are we doing on our research? Getting closer to the power supply. Excellent. Go. Oh, next day. <laughs> Not sure we're going to have this active in this episode. Um, I mean, we can certainly build all of this in one episode. I don't want to in increase it. We'll keep it where it's at on the 8th. But... And then we got to start planning cooling. Oh, let's switch it to a 5. All right, so we're going to bring cooling from over here. I'm thinking what we'll do is we could, this is going to be our main, we could just create a path, right? So we're going to have a pump. We can put the pump there. We can go straight across. Um, eventually we'll have some sort of thing here, so we probably want to raise it to where it comes through here. Yeah. And then it's going to come, have to come up. Whoops. And go several places. This is temporary. So we can turn this into the cooling. Eventually. Let me think. Because we're gonna we're gonna want to do this. This. Yeah. Let's think of how to do this smartly. Deconstruct. to think about how to do this smarter. This is going to be long term. Let's save ourselves. I said research complete. Excellent. We got that done. In order to do the proper cooling, um, we will need this. So HVAC. So we're going we're gonna to go for it. Okay. Now that we got all the pipes cleaned up, here's here's how we can do this. So this is going to come into here, and it's going to go up. Cooling, cooling, and it comes back down through here, and we'll have to take it down into a recycling system somewhere, right? All right. Excellent. These are my oxygen points, so I'm going to come like this, and like this. Um, so, cancel that. Alright. This is my hydrogen, so we're going to take it to here, come over here. And we're going to put in the filter right here. Temporary filter. Boom. Like that. I probably don't need this over here. Um, 
Okay, we'll figure that out in a minute. So, okay, we can't... I just realized. Can't have that there. <clears throat> Has to be one over. Because we gotta make room for that. Like that. Okay. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Then this will power our hydrogen. Then this. Alright, so now. So this is taken care of, that's taken care of. We've got our oxygens. So we probably want to switch this out then to where. Yeah, let's let's cancel this. Let's cancel that. So we're gonna take this this way, and we'll use it eventually. This isn't gonna be online right now, so we're not worried about that. That we can go like this. This is our hydrogen. This is our oxygen coming through here. I think it's gonna be smarter. Oh, we need two. Okay. All right. We're going to deconstruct that. <laughs> We're making a total mess of stuff here in our planning, but it's okay. Sometimes you got to do this. I'm trying to think long term so we don't have to redo stuff. Obviously, the whole power thing is going to change anyways. We're going to move that eventually. Okay, so that's going to be like that. Oxygen's gonna be like this, like that, um, which comes down into here, which basically means now I can take this and I can turn this into the carbon dioxide line that goes downwards um, and to other areas to cool. So we just have to think of where we're going to cool it. So we didn't need this at all. We'll keep this line here because eventually we'll pull this oxygen into it. But we're going to deconstruct this. Oops. Do that. And we're going to deconstruct that one. Okay, cool. There, that's, that's much, much, much better. And then see, we have our hydrogen generators. Um, so we can put one here, one here. Done. Done. This we can hook into this. So where do we want to do that at? There we go. As a byproduct. And then we just need to figure out where to take our carbon, which we're going to take it all the way down into here. And somewhere down here. Um, for right now, though, we can just, we can dump it right there, temporarily. Okay, cool. Well, we kind of got distracted there, did a bunch of different things. We're going to take coal for now. This is tempting, but requires light to sleep now, so we're just going to take the coal and use that. And our skills, we're going to get cooking for speedy. And then on over here, we're going to get you supplying. There we go. Perfect. All right. And we're about to finish up that. Perfect. Oh, we're spilling over. That's good. That's fine for right now. Yeah, that's fine for right now. Alright, well. 
we have a lot to do. So the first thing we have to do is all of that. And then this all the way down to there so that we can get this online. <laughs> cool. Well, I think that um, goes beyond our um, episode length. We uh, redirected a lot there, with doing a lot, changing our mind basically on a lot of stuff. Um, <laughs> so, you know, but that happens. Oh, where's this hydrogen? There we go. <coughs> Still have to hook up the rest of the electrical to all of this. Um, This has 720 watts on it. Is everything hooked up? Everything but this, which is another 240. So that would be 8, 29, 20, 9, 60. So we, can't, we cannot put anything else onto this. Um, as far as a power consumption or power usage, we can put this so that we have some backup power going into it um, because 600 is obviously not going to be enough. And then... This one, um, we can take down into the base as a temporary hookup for all of that. Cool. <laughs> we are set up. And then obviously we'll have to work on our better wiring and stuff and whatnot, <laughs> which we will have shortly. Anyways, we'll see you in the next episode for all of that. Take care, everybody.